Hey there, welcome to the channel. I just did several tests comparing the low light capacity of the A7C2 versus that VE1, and the result is surprising to me. I will just show you the side by side videos and you can decide which has better low light performance. Feel free to pause the video to check the details, especially at the transition from ISO 10000 to 12800. For the first test, I want you to pay attention to the brick wall at the upper left corner of both footages. As we increase the ISO, it becomes more and more noisy. The surprising is, at ISO 6400, we can see that the ZVE1 footage already looks very noisy, and it's even more obvious at ISO 10000. On the other hand, ISO 10000 looks alright on the A7C2. As we change from ISO 10000 to 12800, we can see the ZVE1 footage suddenly cleans up. But up until then, the A7C2 has much cleaner quality. The first test has very intriguing results, so I decided to conduct a second and third test, but using smaller apertures, since there are lots of great lenses on the market that only has f2.8 or f4. This time pay attention to the wall at the upper right corner of both footages. I have always assumed that the ASMC2 has the same second base ISO at 3200 as the A74, but I don't see any quality improvement at the change from ISO 2500 and 3200, so I'm not really sure what is the second base ISO of A7C2, but again, at higher ISO, approximately 5000 to 10000, we can see obviously cleaner footage from the A7C2 than the ZVE1. And only at ISO 12800, the ZVE1 suddenly cleans up and looks better than the A7C2 footage. For the third test, I'm using the same setting, but I set both cameras at f4. Pay attention to the wall at the upper left corner of both footages. And again, we got the same result as from the previous two tests. So, this is a bit tricky. Which camera has better low light performance? It really depends on how you look at it. First of all, I can't really tell what is the second base ISO of A7C2 because as I increase the ISO number, it only gets more and more noisy. But the tricky thing is, from ISO 5000 to 10000, it obviously performs better than the ZVE1. Very interesting result, right? Not sure how to think about it. Leave a comment below to let me know your opinion. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.